lot of my daisy stories in recent videos have been around revenge, persistence, squad domination. It's inconsistent, but it's a lot of fun. And beginning this recent story, me and my two other friends, Camo and Aaron, didn't have a clue of the adventure to come or what we were getting ourselves into. But boy, it certainly wasn't going to be easy. Our journey begins on the coast with no more than a bit of food and hope. But before we go any further, I'd like to thank Dashlane for sponsoring this video. Dashlane is a desktop and mobile app that works on virtually any device and is designed to make all the annoyance of the internet easier and safer. Dashlane has many features all in one package, one of which being that you can save and autofill your passwords and login details on every website out there. You can also save and autofill information like addresses, phone numbers, credit cards, passport details and more, saving you loads of time when filling out online forms. My favourite feature is that it safely saves and decrypts all of my credit card information, making checking out on websites just a simple click instead of searching around for my wallet. Not only is Dashlane the perfect solution to store your valuable information, but it's also got a built-in VPN with a country selection, allowing you to pretty much access anything you like online, no matter where you are. Instead of spending extra money on a VPN, you can save money by getting it with Dashlane Premium. Myself, along with millions of others, have started using Dashlane, and if you'd like to keep your personal information safe too, click on my link in the description for a free Dashlane on your first device at dashlane.com slash JLK and 50% off Dashlane Premium with my code JLK. Thank you again Dashlane, go check them out in the description, and let's get back into the video. Okay, I'm in at the moment. I should probably go towards Three Valleys. It's kind of like at this point, it's just a race to whoever gets to Tizzy, you know? It's a race to Tizzy, basically, at this point. We've got to just set up a base as quick as possible. Oh my god, there's already someone shooting. I see a guy. Everyone's spawning other cars. Everyone is spawning other cars at the moment because I've just wiped. I'm looking for a car, boy. Oops. Hey, you. Hey, hey, you, you mate. Kill me? Did I kill you? Me? No, no, I didn't. I just spawned in. No, you kill me. No, that will kill me now. Kill me. Now. Oh, you want me to kill Watch you? Me. Sure, man. Watch me. Free Watch food. Me. Watch me now. Yeah. No. What spawn do you on, you weirdo? Oh, free food. <laughs> I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Nice. Just, just head inland, dude. I'm heading straight to Staroy. I got a lag transport. At this point in time, this server had just wiped and everyone was spawning fresh at the coast. And me and my two other friends saw this as an opportunity to begin an adventure, get as geared as possible, build a base and hopefully find a car, not having a clue what was ahead of us. But the only goal now was to get as far inland and as geared as we could. Hold on, did I just hear a guy? Hey, I'm friendly, I'm friendly, calm down, I'm friendly. Me too, me too, me too. Hey dude, I've got ammo for that Moser man, do you want some ammo? Yeah, I know who you are, come on. Hey guy, there's some ammo dude, if you want it. No, I don't actually. Oh, alright man, well I'll keep it. Well, I'm gonna keep, because it isn't, it's a race right now to Tizzy. Well, not Tizzy, but the loot. So I'm just gonna get straight yeah, to it, man, yeah, but... Thanks for being friendly. No. Yeah, good luck, good luck. You too, man. Okay, there's a guy at tents, starry tents. He's cool. But, uh, I'm just gonna go straight to the airfield. He's so goddamn geared already. So, oh, hold on, what's this? A laser sight? Hold on. I just found a laser sight. That is insane. 
armored helmet. Really? What is that? What's that from? A oh, modular. I know what it's from. Looks like. I found a cool bag. I found a large canvas bag, dude. Nice. I found an M16. Nice. I see you. Crouch, crouch, crouch. Yeah, I see you. <gasps> Cabo, hello. George. UMP in here. M1A, SOCOM mag. Alright, let's move it. Let's go to Bash, Josh. Run to Bash. Okay, run to Bash, run to Bash. Now that me and Camo had grouped up, we looted Bash and found some important supplies, but our other friend Aaron was on the brink of death due to hunger. So we stashed our heavy bags at a safe distance from Bash and went back to meet and save Aaron. I'm on that road. Surely you should see me. I'm down here, Josh. Down here. Give him a plum, feed him quickly, quickly, just keep him going. Eat, 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 Aaron, eat, eat, eat. Come on, quick. You can do this. You think you'll make it? Yeah, it's going up. Yes! Yes! Well, we've already looted Bash, so we can, we can just go straight to Navai down that way. So if we just cut this way, then no, uh, we should be good. Oh my god, I just found an SVD. Okay, I'm getting out of here. After a long while of searching and almost dying, it was getting late and it was time to collect our bags Call it a night and return the following day. Good night. Good night. Good night. The next day, me, Camo and Aaron logged back in to continue the loot run to build our base. We had almost everything and there wasn't much left to find. Do you want a suppressor for that? If it's spare, I mean, sure, dog. <laughs> Thank you, Camo. So cute of you. I'm coming up. Why All right, let's just find the car lock and start just get on with the base. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm 50 HP right now. you got to remember that. There's okay. no rush. Who, who's this guy? Player, 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 player. Shush, don't move, don't move. I see him as well. Just don't move, just wait a second. He was yeah. geared to shit, mate. Let's jog up to these trees, Camo, and then uh, we'll stash this bag, and then we can keep moving. Yeah. Nails. Shit. Nice. Our bags were still too heavy and weighing us down. A car is exactly what we needed. So again, we stashed our bags away and embarked on a western journey to hopefully find a vehicle or possibly some of the remaining base building supplies. Well, this is a dead man's road. We're only here for the cars, and I don't know if there's going to be any cars here. Ooh. Oh, tent. Uh, castle. Castle? I think so. There was a tent up there. And that was an SKS. You want to move in? Yeah, I knew there was going to probably stuff going on in the castle. In the castle. Yeah, there might be a car in there. You wanna move in then? Yes. Hold on, hold on. Do you see that at the entrance? Yeah. They've got the car that we need. Let's go get it. No, I think they're here. They've driven here and they might get in. Okay, hold on. Let's start moving close. Just crouch, just make it play it slow here, okay? Oh, they're in a good spot. Yeah. Look at the flipping view, man. Dude, we could drive this shit off. I say we wait for these guys. 
to get in. You reckon? Yeah. We need to move down this little hill though. I'm gonna stay here because if they run yeah, yeah. out, I can spray them. Aaron, you got the car battery, right? Mm -hmm. I got the spark plug. This is so risky because if one of them, we, if we die, if one of us dies, we are so far to go. I know, dude, I know. This is why I say, but like, if we can move in, make sure we're in the clear to drive, for me to drive this thing out of here, then we'll be good. But we need to make sure the car has fuel, and it's also got, you know, enough water in the thing, right? So it's, there's a lot of variables here. Raw moment. It's alright, it's alright. You ready to move in? Yeah, they're on the castle, so we have time. Hold on. Oh, there's no wheels on the car. That's what we didn't see around the corner. There are no wheels. They must have them all on their base. Yeah, they've got this whole castle on lockdown. See this big tower here? If yeah. we get on that, we can basically see this whole thing. This whole place. Okay, well, let's try it. Hopefully it's not. Hold on, I'm moving around. I don't know if you can get on top of this tower here. This one that we're under, you know. Well, we need to get on the other side to see. I feel like we could get. It. Well, should we wait if that guy's come comes out of the castle when he opens the door? We'll just pray. Him. We could do that. Could work. Hold on, hold on. There's a better position here. Yeah, he's up on the roof, I think. He's just seen us moving around. He may have... I'm fucking stuck. Oh god, that scared me. Who's moving about? None of Can us. I? No, no, none of us. Other people are here. Other other people are here? Yep. I see one of them on top's car, so do you want me to shoot him and then we go? Yeah, shoot them and then we go. Two of them left the car, sir. Oh god. god. He's talking, he's talking. We need to go. Let's go. God damn, well there's a car there, I mean if we can get all the wheels and everything we can, <laughs> I mean we can get it, but that's if they haven't moved it. It was way too dangerous to pull that off, we had far too much to lose. Instead, we made our way east to Pastoshka and came up with a base idea while looting. We then moved further onto Pogorevka for the final building item we needed. Check this area guys, code lock, code lock, code lock. Oh! I'm dead. You're dead? Yeah. Where were you? No, I'm behind um church. Okay, I'm at there are there's I'm three at houses by the I'm at Christian Hill look, I can't see them. I see one. <laughs> One's hit. I don't see them. Are they near the gas station? Yeah, they're running on the hill. I see them, I see them, I see them. One's gone really far away. I thought they were closer, man. What the hell? No way these guys are gonna escape right here. Like, do you want me to chase them, Kemo? They'll be gone. They are. They're gonna wait for us and just kill us. How many did you see? One or two? Okay, I'm going for them. Cut down tree. I think this might be their base around here. I'll show you the route I want to go though. No, but this is the way they were, right? I know, I know. We want to cut these bastards off. And the hunt was on. Oh, shit, man. That's got to be them, right? Ah, oh, Aaron's body. 
That's them. That's got to be them. That has got to be them, man. Oh, the body's been cut. The body's been cut up? Yeah. Rats, dude. Little rats. Well, I need to go. Okay. Someone's right next to me. Someone's right next to me. Yeah, they're on the calf there, somewhere. Yeah, this is a good spot to be in. Oh, dude, yeah, Aaron, if you can get here with a gun, we can do something here. Kill all these guys. Oh! I went out and wrote move right. Damn. Oh, this is a good spot, dude. God damn, this is a good spot. Yeah, there's a base in there that you could probably boost into. Oh, I see one. to their base. That's what their base is. I'm going to kill this guy. I'm going to see what he does here. Yeah, it is his base. I don't know if he's seen me or not. Oh, they're moving out. Oh, holy shit. Yep, orange armbands. That's the guy that killed Aaron. That one right there. Yeah, I found them. Holy shit, it's a four-man squad. Might be able to catch them in this field. But this is gonna be tough. Yeah, I see them. They're in town. Oh shit. I see them! Do you kill my friend? I'm gonna kill yours. That's how it works. I think they're going to be pushing that tree line, that would be my guess. An eye for an eye, a kill for a kill, I continue to track down and look for the rest of the group, but remembered that their base was still work in progress with a big gap to boost over. So instead of wasting time fighting them, how about me and my friend Aaron break into their base and steal their most important items? Okay, this is it Aaron, you see it? It's a simple boost in. I see the light on. Hold on, it might be safer from the other side. Yep, it's probably safer from this side. I don't know if there's even any storage in there. I don't know if there's even going to be any storage in here, man. I'm in. Oh, good, good. Oh, they got pliers. Don't worry, they got pliers. What else do they have here? Surely. Oh, they got some more loot. Code lock! Jackpot, bro! We've got, we can take their other code lock as well here. Holy shit. Okay, we're taking their code lock, Aaron. Take everything else, pretty much. And we're bloody leaving. Come, 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 come. I got the code lock. Let's, let's go, let's go, let's go. We saw the items we desperately needed to build and made our way back to our stashed bags. There's a base at Aaron, we can jump over it. I'm in, I'm in. Oh shit, dude. Loads of nails. Code lock?
Boys and girls. Uh, I'm not a boy. Oh. <laughs> I am a man. Okay, I'm so sorry. It's okay. So basically, what we've done, right, is we've done a really nice airlock here. Like, really, really? nice, right? Like, really nice. Keep in mind that you can vote here if you get a guy here. Nah, no, this will be good. So look, right here. Okay. But we'll make it can three high then. Fine, we'll make it three high instead. Mm, I don't know, man. No, but it's it's good. It's good. It's good. Trust me. Oh shit! You wanna go for it? I think we should just go for it. That's an M4 shooting. I'm here, I'm here. Shut the shut the door. Oh Holy my shit, dude! <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, yeah, zombie aggro's. That greenhouse. Yeah, greenhouse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You wanna move around? Yeah. Where could he be in there, though? Probably I mean, if you wanna open it, then I could kind of hold it. Well, it just depends on how you wanna play this. Go up on the hill, go up on the hill. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Guys up on the hill. Yep, yep, yep. How many? I'm holding the green. Are you in front of green? No. Oh. He's dead? Yep. I'm low on health, man. There's guys up on that hill. I see a guy on the hill. Yeah, that's them. There's multiples. I want to shoot in a minute. I'm mid. I saw one, I could have. Yeah, I saw one as well. <laughs> and then I got shot from another person, that's how I know there's multiples up there. What do you want to do? Ah, that was such an awkward thingy situation right there. I don't really know. I'm 50 HP now. Yeah, they're no longer up on that hill. They oh. may have moved down there, right? I'm gonna loot him. He's got an M4, M1A SOCOM, a shitload of gear. I need some of his 3 away, dude. Really? Here, right there, load him. Could you uh, grab some stuff for me? Yeah. Ah! I'm hit. Bad, bad, bad. Fuck. I'm stuck in here, bro. Yeah, they've pushed us. Me, killed one, another one hit bad. One, another one dead. Nice. Last one's hit bad. Oh, this one's got to be hit bad. It's got to be low. I, I might have hit him in the arm, I guess. Must have. Well, they are orange arm bands, and uh, our neighbours are orange arm bands, so, and this is not the first run, and these are the same guys that killed Aaron the other day behind the church. All of the loot that we want is all relying on us killing this last guy, you know? Mm. We have to kill him or we can't get any of this loot. Could be up on that original hill that they were at. I don't know, man. I'm looking for him. I'm in the green moustache. I'm 75 HP now, so I can start running around. Where was he when you shot him? He was literally just where they were, where they shot you from. He was in that area. That's where I hit him, and I, I haven't seen him since. He's dead. 
You got him. Yep. So you think this is the last one? I don't know, man. I don't. I'm not seeing the other two dead guys. Got me. Help me. Where are you in the green? Yeah. He's probably He's looking for me. He's hurt. It's probably one of the guys I hit but didn't kill. He's hurt me though. Fuck. Okay, this guy is definitely dead. That's one dead for sure. The one last guy that I thought I'd killed had killed me, but Camo was luckily able to take him out. The problem now was I still had to run back before the enemies, and as I suspected, while Camo was low on health recovering and I was running back, they got to the loop before me and there wasn't much left at all. With the weapons we had, we wiped out some of the Romas and moved over to the orange armband base to see if we could get some revenge and hopefully our loot back. What? I'm dead. But we were too aggressive and impulsive and it backfired. We'd lost the battle and I was bitter but fixated on vengeance. Day three, the next day following our battle with the orange armbands. All three of us individually ran inland to reload and gain back what we'd lost. On my journey, however, while heading through Kozlovka, I took a short break and logged back in 30 minutes to a bit of a surprise. Jeez. Oh my god, just open my window. Oh my god, there are loads of shots near me. Tons of you? shots, AKM shots. I mean, I'm dying of hunger, so I'm gonna die anyway, but I'm just gonna rush these guys wherever they are. Oh, I see one. Oh shit! Are they orange armbands? I think I just saw an orange armband. Are you kidding me? He ran from the. There's one. I've just got to rush this, boys. Oh shit, yeah. They're fighting here. I guess that was a bit of a setback, but I was dying of hunger as it was, so there wasn't really much risk. But yet another encounter with the Orange Armband Clan had fueled my annoyance even more and I wanted these guys done for even more now. So we tried again. We geared ourselves up and ready for whatever was ahead of us. And over the next few days, an opportunity had risen to raid and finish this chapter. Revenge. It feels fucking good.